Alright, it's been a hot minute since I made one of these videos. So, I don't know how it's going to come out or how leg it's going to be. But, I'm going to make one in reference to some things I noticed. As y'all know, I started my modeling site, which is the most badass modeling site i ever been on, ever had, ever co-owned. Uh, it's going really well. Much love to everybody who's part of and will be a part of it. Anyways, one night Dead Wolf. Red Wolf. And don't mind the noise, that's my kind of chat. See? Um. Don't mind my texts and stuff. But. Anyways, as I'm trying to say, so I can. This is in reference to other modern sites I've been a part of and been. As I didn't mean in the past, I've been part of other modern sites and gonna say the names. Uh, one that kind of I left because. I didn't like how it was going. It was set to go in one direction, which is kind of the direction of having it with the heartless now. But it started going in directions where it was almost basically like Playboy, or even where it's turntiles type things, you know, which some models do have, you know, in mind, pics like that is covered or whatever. But the models have their way they can do any kind of pics, any kind of thing they want within the limit, keep nipples covered and et cetera, et cetera. For under 18, of course, you gotta be really careful. Because <coughs> legally, the wrong kind of pictures or anything like that, you get in deep trouble. So we, we go through that with a fine tooth comb. Whatever. You know, but then there's other sites like I don't care if you get mad or this, but you go in one direction, you keep you have the name, you have your set, you going pretty well. A couple years down the line, you want to change your whole direction. Which German online site, you can choose that. Me, I'm going to keep mine the way it is. It's going to stay the way it is. As we got pro, semi pro, just like and coming models, all sizes, male, female, they don't have to look like picture perfect models. <coughs> they're models other on the ground, they're not gonna be normal models, they're not gonna be got well they can be goth, whatever, on the ground, you know. And other sites I've seen like can say no names. You know, which my models can choose to go to whichever site they want to go and model there too. You know, and uh, I have no problem with that. Some modeling sites do. And that pisses me off because models should choose where they want to go. You know, <laughs> then there's other sites, a couple of them. I noticed like. They want you to go to their page and like it, and then go to their site and pay to either buy their magazines, which, you know, most of the modeling pictures in the magazines or the modeling people's up aren't even photographers for your site. They're for their own personal photographers or something like that. <coughs> If you're going to have a paid magazine, make sure you have your own money to afford the photographers to go out to each of the models and pay the models to model for you. That's how I see it, if you're going to do that. If that's the route you want to go. Me, I said, I'm going to do the models the way every model, different model is going to be unique in their own way. They have some similar. Maybe one of the up-and-coming models see something of another one and be like, I like that idea. I'm going to try it and see. 
And if they choose not to be part of it, no problem. You know? They want to be part of other sites. No problem. You know? But there's other sites where, like I said, you go to their site and you see um, their like page or their Facebook. Go in there and you say, oh, look, there's a link to the site. You go to the site. Okay, you have pictures, whatever kind of pictures. You know, and you want them to pay to see more or to see this person new to go here. That's almost like porn. I'm sorry to say, those of you on my Facebook might get mad about it, but basically kind of what it is. It's like you go to porn sites, or you go to playboy.com, or any of those. You want to see more of the beautiful girls? Go here. Click here. <laughs> you know? I love Lex. I love Lex Marley. You know, all that good stuff, but to be honest, if you're doing something that's for the fam, for the underground or whatever, shouldn't you have it where they could check it out for free? Maybe get some merch of your own, like shirts, you know, keychains or the logo. And Maybe posters of the models, you know, things like that you charge for. We'll charge someone to go onto the site just to look at your pictures and stuff. You know? Make your site free or whatever. And do your thing. And one thing that really pisses me off is most sites are competitive very competitive like they don't want other models to model for other companies or they don't want or they go through your modeling page and, or someone posts for you repping the model or for the model friends or back on the site and you go ahead and say you're too good for that site. You shouldn't be a part of that site. Why? Because half the models aren't half naked? Or you're just jealous because maybe they don't want to work for you or something like that. So you gotta go and talk shit. You know? My site's gonna stay the way it is. I have bomb ass co owners, things couple things I need to get done and we'll get done in time. We're still new. We still got like almost 500 strong models. We got bomb ass models, bomb ass kick ass hat staff. Mad shout outs to all of you. You know who you are. You ain't going through this. You ain't drinking Canada, so. Yeah. And rant. Which kind of love.